The astronomers have been looking at the sky, coming to the conclusion that we're looking at the debris stream of a fragmented giant comet through which we pass twice a year. Other scientists, Comet Research Group, have been looking at the ground and making disturbing new discoveries. Uh, this is Bill Napier, he's one of the astronomers, and he's just drawing attention between the astronomical information and the terrestrial information. And he's referring to a catastrophe of celestial origin, which has been postulated to have occurred around 12,900 before the present. That's the Younger Dryas impact. The Earth was hit not by a single object, but by multiple objects, a sort of shotgun scatter of objects, some of which, many of which blew up in the sky, some of which probably hit the North American ice cap. Um, and they've presented compelling evidence for that. If you look at the world during the last ice age, you can see North America, particularly the northern part of North America, was covered in an ice cap two miles deep. So, so also northern, northern Europe. Sea level was 400 feet lower than it is today. Why? Because all that water was in those frozen ice caps. 